had the lead, they come back, they cut it again, they come back. It's just one of those. I mean, it's just like you and I talked about before the game. They're, they're a group of guys in that dugout over there that, that can flat out hit. And, um, you know, no lead is too safe. I mean, 6 3 early in the game. Um, you knew 6 3 wasn't going to hold up, certainly, but, you know, they battled back and, and got those three runs uh, to make it 6 6. And, and then we took that lead. I think on that solo home run by right. Maddie to make it 7-6. Right. And, uh, you know, at the, at the end of a, a long weekend, you're, you're scraping for, for arms in the bullpen. Both teams were, and their guy stepped up. You know, uh, I think he's a sophomore, that left-hander, yeah. um, you know, who, who stepped up for him and, and, and pitched significantly in game one today and then again in, in game two. So, you know, he's you tip your cap to them. They, they executed and they, uh, they did what they needed to do to – Know, to, to win the game. Obviously, we were a little just, we didn't execute near the end of the game to keep us in it. Um, not that we weren't in it, but, you know, 9-7. Uh, we could have held it at 9-7 sure. if we had executed some plays late uh, that, you know, that who knows, would have made it, maybe, you know, maybe a different game. But there were so many, you know, plays throughout that game from, you know, base running. We made a few, I think we made a few too many mistakes there in game three. You know, a few base running mistakes and, uh, you know, didn't get a call here or there. You know that could, that could have helped us out. That would have uh, give, given us a run. Home run. They made it 9-7. It's an 0-2 pitch. It just o 2 pitches all weekend. I mean, it's been a uh, it's been a the, you know the mo for us uh, at least this weekend. It hasn't been all season, but you know 0-2 pitch on two pitches that he had just chased out of the zone. Um, you know I'm not going to knock Ryan George. That kid is a huge part of our program and, and where this program has come uh, from when I took over here, but. Uh, I think he just missed a spot on that. I mean, I mean, he couldn't. Put, I mean, <laughs> I know where it went. I mean, it, it was couldn't have been a better pitch to hit. If I feel like I could put one on the highway, then it's it's probably not a great pitch, especially 0-2. Yeah. You know, anywhere out of the zone, and, and he was so eager to swing. I thought he would have chased out of the zone. Um, you know, and then if, if that's the case, and we get him right there, we get the next guy out as well. And, and now you're looking at a 7-6 game going into the eighth inning, uh, which. You know, it was obviously a, a, a whole different feel in this dugout comparatively. So I mean, the guys are disappointed. Obviously, they're they're not you know they're not happy. I think it'll be a while before they leave the dugout. But uh, you know, it's a great group of kids, great school to be at uh, as a student, as an employee. Um, you know, this is the worst. You know, tomorrow will be the worst day of the of the calendar year, and it always is when the season's over. And then you gotta you know, take a day to pitch and moan, and then grind it out. You know, on Monday, start recruiting and try to get better. But Greg, the three years you've been here, look at you have succeeded in doing. I'm not, I know it's not just know. you, but you know, well, what I know. I'm saying. No, I know. We've changed the culture. Is... We've changed the culture in this program. Uh, this is a place that kids want to come to. It's a hard-nosed, uh, blue-collar team. It's a fun team to play for. Um, the coaching staff uh, relates well to the players. Um, you know, I think this is a great place to be uh, for those guys and. You know, we've, our expectations have increased each year. You know, we expect to win, you know, 25 to 30 games every year. We expect to be in this series every season. Um, and that's not my goal. So those are the goals of right. those guys. So. But I can tell you, before you came here, they, they weren't even talking like that. Now, uh, you, now I, you can. Yeah, I know how it was before, and I appreciate that. But, uh, again, it's about, you can say all you want as a coach, but it's about, you know, having the guys buy into it. Uh, and you know, if the players buy into it, then it makes it, a hell of a lot easier to coach here. It's, it's taken a while, but it's uh, it's like we've turned the corner pretty quickly. So we're, we're excited. We're excited. Not excited right now, but uh, we will be once we get once we tee it up again uh, in the fall. Absolutely.